Hey everybody, Brett from Stars Gaming here, back with part 19 of our Crusader Kings 2 Elder Kings mod Let's Play. And so hopefully all you big Elder Scrolls fans are enjoying the new Skyrim series we started this week. Um, but don't worry, Crusader Kings 2 isn't going anywhere. Um, Cortex Command's not going anywhere. Warband, however, is probably going to sit on the back burner until one of the other series finishes, though. Because Warband seemed to be the least popular of the bunch. And, um, so I'm going to push it back a little bit. Um, if there's enough demand for it, I'll try to fit it in alongside something else. Um, sort of like how this video is going to go up alongside Cortex Command on, let's see, I'm recording this on a Thursday. It'll probably go up on, um, Friday, Friday the 7th. Um, so yeah, but hopefully this little shakeup kind of rejuvenates the channel because I don't like letting the viewership sort of tail off, especially being such a small channel. I got to keep the growth going. So let's see. Last episode, we, oops, I keep pressing the WASD to move. I need to press the arrows. We took Cambria from, well, I forget who we took it from. It was, they were basically briefly independent they broke away from North Point um, and we pretty much immediately latched on and took it so we could probably expect a follow-up attack from North Point at some point but I'm not gonna worry about it too much for right now let's go ahead and get these children some guardians my half-brother's son let's uh, who's this guy it's not bad but uh, I'm better. You know, let's go with this guy. And then, who else? Princess, so my daughter needs a... Teacher as well. Perfect, yeah. She's actually really good. Her diplomacy is not that great, though. And who's the last one? My other daughter. Okay. So, sure, why not? I've heard her teach both of them. And there we go. Let's get this running. I don't care about any of that. Well, okay, we're going to pause this again. Who is this? This is my grandson. Okay. Uh, he's vigorous. Uh, he's not bad. Let's go ahead and educate him ourselves. Because, let's see, who's our other ward? Ah, right, our other son. So, he might be the heir. However, if this kid shakes out to be better, then we can always make our eldest son the heir, and then he'll eventually inherit. So, either way, we want to be in control of both of these guys. Let's get the clock running, because I've already talked too much, and then let's make sure these guys aren't leading any armies into battle. Um, got another one, huh? Oh, she just came of age. So, who's going to teach her? Uh, sure, why not? Don't really care at this point. We've got so many daughters. Let's see. Seeing another woman behind my spouse's back is becoming quite troublesome for me. Who are you seeing? Um... I don't know who he's seeing. Scheller? Okay. I don't know who that is. Not one of the queens, though. I'm just going to go ahead and end it. If we get Chast, that's fine. We don't need any more kids, and our stewardship will go up, so it's not a big deal. Doesn't look like we got it, though. Tyrant? Really? When did we get Tyrant? We haven't been all that tyrannical. Let's see. My grandson has a tender, loving soul. Trusting everyone in the castle, I feel hurt. I fear he'll get hurt someday. Um, what does he need? He probably needs some intrigue. Envious. Yeah, let's let's shoot for that. Looks like he didn't end up with either. Oh well. Um, 
We've been at peace for too long. We haven't really been at peace that long at all. But unfortunately, we're still waiting on our Chancellor to pull something off here. We've tried Manavia. We've tried Sharnhelm. We've tried Garrett. Uh, we've even tried Lorient here, and we just haven't had any luck in regards to getting claims. Oh, and it looks like Sharnhelm actually managed to expand. They actually took... Darguard from... Sorry about that guys, Alex just came home. Um, so we got a little event here. Uh, my ward is inquisitive and asks so many questions it's hard to answer them all. I try my best for every answer I give, but he seems to like me even more. Um, I think we'll become friends, so we're gonna become friends with our grandson. Okay, that's good I suppose. Friends, so our half-brother and our grandson. Uh, we don't care about her. Uh, let's see, my nephew became, oh, came of age, okay, alright, the, the brother with the ridiculous mustache had a son with the ridiculous mustache, and let's see, he had a daughter, hmm, not a whole lot else going on here. Again, I'd like to weaken, I'd like to focus our efforts down here. Uh, Wayrest is just so ripe for the taking right now. Especially if we can, if we can manage to take like Alcare here. Um, and, you know, in, in, inevitably Wayrest. Let's, uh, let me finish that thought in a second. Uh, Daddy, where do children come from? Oh boy. Let's see, diligent, deceitful, and cynical. Cynical's not that bad. Trusting, Craven, Deceitful, none of those are very good. None of these are very good. Let's go with this one. So, yeah, Cynical's not terrible. She's actually going to end up really good, too. She's got Quick. Yeah, so what I was saying is um, if we can manage to take these coastal provinces down here, we can build Trade Posts, and that'll give us huge boost to our income. Uh, our nephew, Kaputo, is still not married. Okay, well, you're only 21, dude. Let's see, what are our options? 14, 26. Uh, I don't want to marry... They're like Daedra worshippers, so I don't want to bring them in here. Let's go for her. A decent amount of money, but okay, there's that. Ideally, we'd be making enough to where I could start building these things up, but we just haven't had the the funds. Like 121, that's basically our whole whole account, bank account. So, and I'd like to be able to build like castles and other holdings too. It just doesn't look like it's going to happen anytime soon. But again, being able to take these coastal provinces would help us big time in that regard, because it would give us a huge boost to our income. Too cynical for his age. Uh, let's see. What's going on? He's like cynical, brave, green spore. What is this? Oh man, did that just happen? That sucks. Hopefully that doesn't stay. God damn it. Um, Cynical's not that bad though. I don't really care. But yeah, we'll do that. I don't want to lose Zealous for us. Yeah, hopefully that disease goes away. I don't know. Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and grab our 
perform charity that heals, right? Um, let's see, none of these. Yeah, it's got to be perform charity. Let's see if that helps cure diseases or anything. I hope it, I sure hope it does. I mean, because if he falls through, our only backup plan is this guy and his son. Who, I mean, the son might actually turn out to be pretty decent, but that remains to be seen. This kid was really good until he got that disease that took out all of his diplomacy. See, another child lacks a guardian. Who is this? Oh, it's Mustache Guy's next kid. Let's have, uh. Who's this guy with all the hair? Sure. Actually, you know what? I like having this guy teach because he's got no intrigue, so hopefully none of his students have high intrigue. Because that doesn't really benefit me unless they're my, uh. Spy Master. Which they are not, so. Oh, come on, Manavia. Uh-oh. Somebody died of depression. Okay, so... Apparently he wasn't anybody important, but he was educating somebody. So we'll fix that. And let's see, my dear king, I wanted to thank you for your virtuous rule. You're an inspiration. Okay. It's nice of you to say. Oh, he took his crown off. While pondering over the guest list for the banquet, I wondered if I should invite one of my friends. Of course. Why not? Let's see. I rush around trying to get everyone to work harder, not smarter, to get everything ready for the banquet. When the guests started to arrive, I waited impatiently for Broke Hill, but still did my best to make sure every guest felt welcome and found its designated place at my table. Okay, so his opinion goes up. Cool. Definitely want to keep your spy master very close. Although everybody in our court's pretty fond of us. So that's good. Um, let's see. Our grandson is also our friend. Lots of marriage ties. A couple of allies. Although, I mean, they're allies that hold territory in our territory so it's not that big of a benefit no holy orders or anything I'd be interested to see holy orders in an Elder Scrolls setting like uh, the vigilance of Stendar would that count they're more of like witch hunters than they are like a holy order of knights though at least that's how they're sort of depicted in Skyrim where seeks to kill princess Oh, that's... Okay, we need to look into that. Known plots. So I don't care about that one, but this one... Some random guy is trying to kill our daughter, so that's obviously not okay. And these two are in on it. Can I imprison her? Um... View this tyrannical, okay. Apparently I can't imprison her. Just him. Uh let's see. Since we have evidence that he is the leader of a plot, no one will object. Yeah, sorry, we don't we don't just end those, we uh throw you in jail for that. Now what can we do with him? You execute him, banish him. Uh, she's afraid of the dark. Well, you kind of had a legit reason to be with somebody trying to kill you. Uh, let's see. 30% diligent. Uh, I'm going to risk getting trusting. I'd rather have trusting than craven, I think. Actually, martial versus... You know what? I think that's the better way to go. Craven, okay, yeah. But I don't really care about her martial skill. Having a high intrigue will be more useful for her. She's ill. How's this kid doing? Oh, he's he's healed. That's perfect. Good, good, good. 
It's complaining about the dark cell. Uh, sorry, dude. I don't really care. Ah, oh, man. Can we... Can we hurry this up? We're losing... We're hemorrhaging prestige, too. Lorient. They're still part of North Point, so we can't really do much about that. I'm not sure exactly how far north I want to go. While individuals who procure illicit goods are always present, um, let's go ahead and aid the local populace now that we can afford to. But I think Dargard's probably going to be the extent of how far north we go. Unless, you know, if we end up taking over the whole peninsula, obviously we'll go further north. But I kind of like using these mountains as, like, a barrier. And so we wouldn't want to extend anywhere past that because this obviously has a full side open. So that was that's basically one front we'd have to defend, where if we took this, we'd have to defend two fronts and so on and so on. So we don't want to do that. At least not yet. Uh, sure. I don't really care. How are we on time, actually? I'm not sure. Um, Hall of Dirg from Chief... I can't even... I'm not even going to try. So he died, okay. Um, my son always has his nose in the scriptures. Okay, what, Zealous? Marshall plus two. I will not raise the Zealous. I don't care. Um... One learning, five favor, and two marshal, sure. Yeah, he's doing pretty good. Pretty good for a 12-year-old. Uh, I'm going to pause right here and take a look at the time. I'll be right back. Okay, so we're at about 17 or 18 minutes, so we'll run in about another 7 or so. We'll shoot for about 25. So, I guess we'll just keep this running until something happens. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like it. I'm tempted to move our Chancellor once again because, I don't know, after having them sit for a while, I just don't feel like... I know it's based on a percentage chance every like month, but I feel like if they've been there for a couple years, it's not going to happen. And so I'm tempted to just like move them. This actually wouldn't be a bad target. However, it looks like Daggerfall's going after it. Let's actually see what this war is all about here. I imagine it's probably for the little province they took down here. Defending against King Timothy of Daggerfall in Daggerfall War for Baroness Annabelle's claim on Alcare. No, so they're after this, yeah. They are going right after this. But yeah, just keep weakening each other, that's fine. I actually didn't read what that said, I probably should have. Uh, let's see, Smuggler's Ring, okay, Steward Improved Economy, let's see, the Twists and Turns of Ger Larzob's Tongue and the White Lies he uses to make friends is making my head spin, how can such a young lad be able to lie so well? Well, who is this? This is my grandson. Honestly, diplomacy is probably the best way to go just in case he ends up being the heir. I'm gonna go with this. Okay, he's honest now. Yeah, I'd rather have that four there than the three here. Let's see, you got another child. God, there's so many kids coming of age, or not necessarily coming of age, but becoming old enough to uh, to learn under somebody. Let's see, this guy became a master bard. He's just my nephew. I, he's okay as like a backup spy master. And you know, I'm gonna go ahead and. Hmm. Another one, really? Wow. It must be like all my daughters coming of age at once. Sure, I don't care. Um, so somebody was saying there's a certain part on here that'll tell you where or how many troops the 
enemy has access to, but I don't really see it. No, we don't care about that. So we'll just have to kind of assume based on... Okay, so they're... I think we would be able to take them if we were able to like pull this like Garrett away from them or Mark Weston. But uh, I don't know if we want to head up there just yet. This almost seems like a better option right here because he's independent. So I think I'm going to take advantage of that. We'll go down here and take this one and then we can slowly work our way south. Obviously, Manavia would be ideal because having a city, a castle, and a temple all in one province would be a huge boost for us. But that doesn't look like it's going to happen. And not a whole lot. Oh, I should probably keep the clock running, yeah? Hmm, but yeah, not a whole lot going on here, one way or the other. Looks like Daggerfall is going to take Alcare. Actually, what's what's the war score here? 27 in favor of Daggerfall, okay. I'm surprised they haven't, like, reclaimed this yet, because that would boost their war score pretty considerably. But it looks like they are working on this. They're in the process of taking this here. Uh, good. Let's actually look at our technology while that goes. Cavalry, magical training, fine arts. Uh, you know what? I think cav. Well, let's see. Can we see what our distribution is? Not really, no. We'd have to raise them to find out. I'm not too concerned. Let's go ahead and go for cavalry. And... I'd rather go for Majesty than Fine Arts, but this seems like it's going to take a while. Actually, no, we're actually almost there. Come on, man. Who is she? You know what? I'm going to say it's not appropriate, and then we'll just, like, marry her. Because we have another slot. I uh, thought we would be first. Let's see. Okay, so we have to go through him. And I have no idea. The, I should probably just sort by name. There she is. And let's take the prestige. We could use it. Okay, so now we've got three wives again. And what's her... She wants to become Magister. Sorry, you're probably not good enough. Yeah, I'm not anywhere near good enough. Uh, let's see, patience is a virtue, but sometimes it gets on my nerves. My son never loses his temper. Patience. Patience is actually a really good trait. Yeah, I mean, he's, he's shaping up to be pretty solid. Depending on what his, like, learned... Okay, so we reigned for 10 years, that's cool. Let's go ahead and choose the ambition once again. Um, reigning for 20 years probably isn't a smart choice because that'll take a while, we can choose that later. 500 wealth ain't gonna happen anytime soon. Neither is the prestige. Obtain an artifact. Let's go for a pilgrimage because we can kind of control that. Now, I suppose I'll just go ahead and end the episode here since I'm already paused and we're about where I was shooting for time-wise. So, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, let me know in the comments what you guys are thinking about the series so far. And I will see you back here for part 20 of our Crusader Kings 2 Elder Kings mod let's play.